I'm beating this game because I love it. <laughs> I've beaten this game many times before, like a lot. <laughs> I've beaten this game a lot. Like, look at the hours on it. <laughs> but uh, I'm going to actually stream it. I'm going to show people the game because <laughs> I love it so much. And I think people need to see it because it's kind of a dead game. Like, not many people know about it, and I want more people to see it. So, that is why I am doing this. <laughs> so, let's just, let's just go into it. I'm probably gonna have to finesse, like, the audio situation because it was bad last time. I checked the VOD, and it was not great. <laughs> Bird, bird, bird. Okay. Oh yeah, figure out the audio first. Oh no. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I'm already messing up. Okay. Thank god there's batteries in my controller. Because I like playing this game on the controller. I don't know why. No wait. Oh god, there's no batteries in my controller. Oh my god. Okay. Let me. I apologize for this. <laughs> I'll, be, I'll be here. I'm getting batteries. Oh my god. This is a great start. <laughs> okay. I will be right back. I'm getting batteries. Let me edit this. Okay, I'm getting batteries. <laughs> okay. I'll be back in a second. Okay, that didn't take long. <laughs> that didn't take as long as I thought. So let me just fix this. God, why did I make that a cap? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god. This is... Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna save it like that, and then, uh, let's get just, <laughs> let's get, let's actually, let's actually do this this time. <laughs> let's actually do this correctly. <laughs> Goodness, dude. I am just, I'm a mess right now. Okay, but it's fine. Nobody's here. Person left. It's all good. Okay, now. <laughs> now let's actually start. Okay, so... Oh god. Uh, so... to like adjust my mic but I'll figure that out in a sec okay that sounds better and let me 
Yeah, I think that's gonna be loud. Okay. I will try to like move my mic in a way or hit my voice. <laughs> okay. This is gonna be a mess. This is technically like my second stream, but I'm gonna beat this game. As I said, I love it. And I wanted to show people this game. <laughs> so let me just get into it. Um, I was doing this one, but it's fine. Okay, there are a bunch of modes here. <laughs> and Cakewalk is pretty easy. I've beaten the game several times in here. I don't think I've ever beaten an easy or normal or hard over time. <laughs> This game sound would be good. You? Okay. I was working on that, actually. I was literally just working on that. Oh, no. God. Sneak peek. This is a sneak peek. <laughs> You're not allowed more game. <laughs> okay. Hey, <laughs> Rec Beard. <laughs> okay. I love the music. But, okay. Get out of the way. <laughs> it's changed to the same. Run it. The setup again with right click. Okay. Um, okay. Is this better? Okay. So I just adjusted my mic. Let me let me exit, and then okay, we'll figure this out. <laughs> I literally just left and came back because I didn't have any batteries in my controller because that's how I like to play the game. <laughs> or I didn't have good batteries. Okay, the game is definitely quieter at this point. Okay. Whew. Good, good. Okay, now. <laughs> I don't know which game mode I should do. Maybe, I'm thinking, I'm thinking I'm definitely not gonna do, like, redonkulous. Because I've tried it, and it truly is redonkulous. Like, the enemies are, are way harder. And, uh, it's been a while since I've beaten the game in general, so I think I'm gonna go for, like, a lower one. <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna... Hate the earth. Okay. Let me just do easy. Because, yeah. So this is the game. You are a panda. And it is an adventure. I know. Pretty crazy. But, this is your master. He's gonna, he teaches you stuff. <laughs> okay. So the character's name is Foo. Would you describe the adventure? Yes, I would, actually. Today is the special day, actually. It's crazy. The training is almost complete. And our master is like extremely proud of us. <laughs> yeah, so our master's name is Master Wushu. <laughs> yeah, I need no pinging to join a stream. Okay, so yeah. Basically, you're just going to a closing ceremony of this princess. And yeah. It's just like a princess type of thing. You have to save the princess or whatever. But it's time to party. Uh, but I need to get my training sword. Because, like, yeah, you need to bring a sword to a party. Like, why wouldn't you, right? You gotta have some protection. Look at these flowers. They're so nice. And look at that. I'm already taking damage. <laughs> <laughs> I'm already taking damage. Let's go. Such a good game, dude. <laughs> I'm probably gonna be doing that a lot. But like when I get closer to the the end, I'm probably not gonna focus on the chat as much because uh, some of these battles get kind of intense. Like honestly, <laughs> I might 100% it, but I don't think I've ever 100% it. <laughs> Look at these enemies. Oh my god. There's enemies. There's literal enemies, dude. Oh my god. I've never seen enemies in a game before. I didn't even know that was a 
thing. Okay, going back. Gotta let our master know what was happening. Oh goodness, I <laughs> went past the text. That was unfortunate. Very good. Is something wrong? Yeah, there was a bunch of blobbies. That's what they're called. They're called blobbies. I had to literally, like, stab them and murder them. <laughs> yeah, they, they invaded. And we have to get some fresh Logan berries. Ooh. They are my favorite as well. They're, like, such good berries. Like, oh my god. So we gotta go here to get some berries. Oh, come on. I totally had to. Alright, that's a later thing. And also, I'm not bringing my shield, which I definitely should. <laughs> but this is easy mode. Like actual easy mode, so. <laughs> I don't need to yet. I don't need to worry about being safe yet. But just gathering stuff is kind of is, is pretty good. <laughs> just good in general to do. <laughs> okay. Okay. I will turn it up in a second. That's good, right? I think that's fine. Or I'll bring them like a little bit closer. There we go. Okay, so these are the perks. So you earn points every time you level up, and oh my god, there's somebody lighting up fireworks. Because of course it's it's July, right? Yeah. So you can have perks, but um, you can only go up to a certain level. So you have to like choose correctly or choose wisely. And I always like to put up my health at the beginning. I just get it all the way up at the beginning, just get that out of the way. Also, <laughs> I also talked to this girl, but her uh, puppy is gone, so she can't come to the ceremony. So I have to go find it. So that's gonna be a later thing. So now I'm back. And now, the party. Get to go to a party. Yeah, they're going literally insane. Yeah, I'm going to find it, okay? I'm gonna find it. It's gonna be fine. Okay? Okay. What is Fu gonna do when he sees the princess? Like, why is he so excited, bro? It's just a princess. Like, it's fine. I don't know. Going to the party. Look at that. It's Princess Maya. Oh yeah, she's like super shy. <laughs> Look at this dude. He just barges in. Yeah, someone uninvited stands in the door. Yeah, you have a valid excuse. I'm good with that. I would allow that. Yeah. I am the future of your world. <laughs> a metallic voice answers in a menacing tone. Look at Fu. Yes. Look at him. He is ready. He is literally ready, dude. Look at him. Look at his face. He is so ready to destroy who... Whatever. Who cares? I'm just ready, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. He literally just get knocked. He got knocked out, dude. That's... I think that's pretty hilarious. Like... He was just, like, so ready, and then he just got immediately knocked out. <laughs> but look at this. Everything's in rubble. 
everything is awful. Look at the look at the houses. Like everything is just. I don't know why the shop is in rubble. Like I don't understand that. <laughs> I don't understand that part. <laughs> it's a cow, and it says no. But oh no! Look, it's our master. It's our master. Oh no! They have taken her. I couldn't. Oh, yep. Yep, the, the very classic master passing away, so you have to avenge him. Yep, he's not strong enough. And then he literally, like, dissolves into nothing. Like, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> but we gotta avenge him. So let's go avenge him, right? Right. So then we go to Cherry Mountain Camp. Go to this camp. So we have to find our best friend in the world to help us in our quest. sometimes just get in a trance of this game because I just love it so much <laughs> so you might you might there might be a few dry spots where I'm not saying anything because I'm just I'm just in the zone with this game and also I apologize for any like computer like button presses that you might hear because I prefer to play with controller. <laughs> oh yeah, I love this game. I've played it for like at least five years. Like at least five years at this point. Like I have over a hundred hours in it. Just all of it was casual. Like I just... I've beaten it at least like a dozen times. And I hate this part. Because the enemies just like they just they just swarm the top of here, <laughs> and it sometimes takes forever to jump up there. <laughs> but I'm lucky that they're in that spot. Fighting you, dude. Is that all you got? He's angry. Yeah. Yeah, he's just ready to fight, you know? Because, yeah, he has so many things to avenge for. Like, he needs to save the princess, he needs to avenge his master. Like, he's determined. Oh, but this is Tyler. It's Tyler! Oh my god. I can't believe it. It is. And the only Tyler. It's Tyler, dude. It is our best friend in like the entire world. And this is the first time meeting Tyler. Tyler is like amazing dude. Yeah. He's just incredible. But he does make fun of our clothes, so he's kinda mean at first, but it's all good. 
It's up. Because it's Tyler, dude. Because it's literally Tyler. And this is one of the first areas where it's in the dark. And you can't see much, because it's the dark. that you can, uh, you can collect all over the place and then they open certain doors. And that's basically a, the point of, uh, the keys. It's just collecting secret stuff and moving the story forward. It's like blocking certain areas. So it's just another element. I have everything full. Open. Open says me. Also, do you want to see some quick moves? Boom! Quick moves! And I get a bunch of XP and coins. Let's go. Uh, let's do some sort of mastery, because why not? Get over here. Walked forward. Whoa! Oh no! <laughs> I didn't jump correctly. Also, I'm gonna try this. Uh, no! Oh. Sometimes you can jump up here while that's loading, while this block is loading, and you can like just be pushed up here. I was not quick enough. I was not enough of a gamer. I don't know why, like, they fill you up here, and then they give you a blobby, and then they give you a cherry, which refills everything. Like, why, why, why would you do that? I don't know. And then Tyler tells us, because now we have an orb, we go down and talk to this dude, Mr. Dwarf. Oh yeah, it's a power orb. Mr. Dwarf is the best. He just like gives us armor. Like, such a nice dude. Like, oh my god. And he, then he just gives you a second orb. Oh my gosh. Okay, <laughs> see you in a bit. But yeah, like, that dude is like so nice. And, boom. I have the knight sword now. It's an extra insanely. Awesome soul. <laughs> oh yeah, I look like a warrior, dude. Oh, rather a fuzzball and a pink. Yeah, Tyler can be mean sometimes, but it's all good. Cause Tyler is my best friend. <laughs> yeah, like Tyler is the best, but he's also a little. Okay, going to the Bloppy Forest to go check stuff out. And there's also a bunch of free stuff down here. Okay, Bloppy Forest O'Clock. And this is the first boss battle that you do. This is the first boss battle that you do. And it's a uh, very easy. <laughs> Like, even at, like, basic, like, level 100 type of thing, it's easy. You just need to know how to do it. And you don't even really know how to do it. It's just, like, a very easy boss battle, which makes sense. It just makes you accustomed to the battles in this game. Oh, yeah, good stuff. <laughs> yeah, it just gets you accustomed. Here we go! It's a big blob. It's a metal one. So you can basically just damage boost through the entire fight. Like, it's fine. Like, boom. <laughs> like, super easy. 
Oh, and the best thing in the game, the grappling glove. Now, look at this. Look at this. Watch this. Watch this. Whoa. I can grab. I have the power to grab. And this jump is kind of weird. <laughs> but I have the power to grab. And also, I get a bunch of friends. Oh, you just missed it. I just beat the first boss, and I got a grappling glove, so now I can grab onto stuff. Yeah, I can grab now. It's pretty crazy. And also, I need to spend some of my points. <laughs> yeah, I'll just, I'll just do that. for this door over here. So you can get this early. <laughs> okay. Here we go. So now, I gotta go back to Tyler. I gotta talk to Tyler again. Now I can grab stuff so I can get up here without having to go back down. Or having to travel my way up. I can just climb up the entire mountain. Like, Fu is so cool. Oh yeah. yeah. So yeah, the, the robots are taking over. I have to defeat the eight robot masters. Yeah. <laughs> Never mind. You just told me something ginormous, dude. You can't just say never mind. <laughs> okay? You can't do that. <laughs> He's like, yeah, it's a super dangerous mountain. You should totally go there. So yeah, Tyler is like the best and the worst. So, yeah. Um, let me just get some more food, because why not? Oh, let's go. That is pretty dope. Your computer is literally a penguin now. That's insane. Okay, so this is Vanilla Rock. This is the super dangerous place that Tyler wanted me to go to. And I'm gonna hit that, because why not? Even though it's not needed, though. Okay, so I think I'm gonna 100% this, right? Sure. Oh, 100% it, so I'll just do this area. So yeah, this area is not needed in our own playthrough. Oh, these birds. Ugh, the first of many, many birds. That bird, dude. It's... It is very annoying because of its pattern. And I'm gonna have to show you the name of it at the end of the stream when, I'm, when I beat the game. Or, when I beat the game, I mean. Like, the... The bird is very annoying, but basically, when you get a high enough sword, I can just you can just one shot it, which is very nice. Well, if it's a placebo, then that's fine, because <laughs> placebos work. Like, why are you doubting placebo? <laughs> Whoa! Okay. Fighting these things. Okay. Uh, oh no. <laughs> Almost fell. Okay. 
I'm gonna stop him for a second so I can reach out. <laughs> That's much of either. Yeah. If I'm good background noise, then sure. You can do that. Oh yeah. Half a heart. Boom. Amulet of a life. Oh yeah. That's half of an amulet that I need to get. Let me I just have, uh, windows. I know. I'm boring. I got the windows. <laughs> and bird. Okay, I got it. Also, here's another part where you can just, like, travel upward. Boom. I'm so cool.
bet it was pretty close. How big is the spider? Like, like how big is this spider we're talking about? Like, honestly. What is this? This stone looks like it has come from another world. I got a black stone. <laughs> yeah, that sounds pretty big, actually. Look at this. It's, it's a hologram. <laughs> Are you a g -g 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 ghost? A ghost? Trapped inside of the stone. This is, so this is Fiona, and uh, she helps us a bit. Ooh. Oh, yep, we gotta we gotta take her to a to a place in the desert. But first, we gotta visit Tyler. Oh my God, Tyler! save the dog at the desert. We get to save the dog. It's the size of your palm? Oh god, dude, that's that's a, that's a pretty big spider, actually. <laughs> that's, that's a pretty big one. That one is, that is too big. But tears. We get to save the dog. As you said, it was very important. So we get to save the dog. And I will save it first. I'll do that first while I'm here. That will be the first thing I do. Tarantula? Oh goodness. Also, I got hit trying to just look in the awe of the dog, but uh, it's fine. It was worth it. Okay, go away. So I can. Boom. I found the dog. Let's go. But yeah, that's a, that's a pr pretty crazy that <laughs> a tarantula showed up to the villa in the corner. much of the game. <laughs> and yeah, we should definitely ask Sapphire or Asta. Oh my god. This bunny needs to like, chill. I just need to chill on not looking at the screen. 
need to look at this crap. He's in a perfect position. I'm not avoiding any damage. Boom, 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 boom. I got the blue key. Let's go. Well, that makes sense. Because, yeah, that's basically what Australia is known for. You can literally die anywhere at any time <laughs> because of just one insect getting in your house. so good. Like, he is 100% a cowboy. I would have never expected him to be uh, a murdering robot. Yeah. This is where you get the boomerang. Get a boomerang. That's a shuriken boomerang. <clears throat> but first, you have to talk to your uncle up there. But first, to get that, I have to max up my sword. It is my uncle. <laughs> yeah, and his sunglasses are literally like gone. Yeah, they're just somewhere. <laughs> well, yeah. That, yeah, that makes sense. But, yeah. Everybody's got fears about, like, dumb stuff. So it's not like... It makes sense why it's your like least favorite thing about yourself, but yeah, it's, it's not like a, a bad or horrible thing. Like, we all have got weird fears. Like I get anxiety for like no reason sometimes, and I'm like, why? Spiders is like one of the most common fears. Like, actually, one of the most. <laughs> I think it's up there with public speaking. Because I think public speaking is number one for most common fear. It's probably like number two or something for spiders. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, everybody in my house is a designated spider remover. <laughs> we just we just get rid of them. <laughs> yeah, none of us are like too scared of spiders. So yeah, we all just get rid of them. But one of the funny things is that like afraid of centipedes. Like, there was one time she was in the basement and there was, like, two big ones, and she was, like, yelling at me to, like, come downstairs and help take care of them, and <laughs> it, was, it was kind of fun. <laughs> like, it's kind of, it kind of sounds bad, but <laughs> it, it, was, it was fun. It was just a little fun. Yeah, makes sense why people are also afraid of centipedes. <laughs> like, yeah. Yeah, that's a, that's a good thing. Yeah, we don't have to think about them like, often. It's very every once in a while type of thing. Centipedes and yeah, they're kind of they're kind of weird looking. <laughs> oh, oh, jeez. Ugh, I forgot to read the, the thing. Grants <laughs> you natural regeneration when you fall below fifty percent. Nice. I don't have like problems with that here, but yeah, scorpions are a thing that I don't think I would enjoy that much. Like, yeah. Not a preferred thing to see the scorpions. Like I'm already annoyed at like flies and spiders being in my house. I don't want dang scorpions. <laughs> but that reminds me of other things that like to come to my house occasionally. It's, uh, bats. Like, bats actually, like, show up in my house every once in a while. Like, just, like, late at night or at, like, random times of the day, bats would just, like, come into my house. And we would have to either shoo it out or try to kill it. <laughs> and we had, like, no idea how they came in. But, like, uh, we got rid of our chimney recently, and there was a bat that flew out when somebody was getting rid of the chimney. So, uh, yeah, good to know that they're uh, not coming back. <laughs> but yeah, there's a, there's a very interesting story about a bat that came into my house. So me and my friend, we were upstairs in my room and like playing uh, just like some random game. And my friend was sitting to the left of me and the door was closer to, to them. And like, uh, they like saw something like going past them they, they didn't know what it was but we were playing like a horror game so they were like eh just in like my imagination right like yeah makes sense but then they looked and it was just a bat just circling and flying past the door and as soon as I noticed I immediately closed the door and texted my parents like there is a bat in the house <laughs> like <laughs> like, just a random bat in the house. And it wasn't even, like, it might have been, like, six. And it was, like, in the summer. So it wasn't even, like, that dark out. It was, like, like eight, maybe. <laughs> like. Yeah. But that was, a uh, multiple years ago. And not, and definitely before that arona 
so yeah, uh, seeing seeing bats like every two years was uh, pretty interesting. And I'm glad uh, that is not happening anymore. Cause yeah. <laughs> Gotta be glad for that. <laughs> oh yeah, we get a reward for returning the dog. it or like try to claw it like she would not be happy at all if there was another cat in the house let alone if there's a cat outside in her yard like yeah <laughs> but yeah that is very cute it's just my cat my cat is the weird one that doesn't allow any other cat to be in the house <laughs> like ever <laughs> something that I forgot. And you want to fall down later so you can get that. A lot of intricate parts here. do this in this part. I always forget to go this way first. I always think I have to go the right first, not the left. Okay, but that's fine. Not that much of a detour. Please, nothing regenerate. Okay. Whew. I 
also have to talk to the wizard. It's the wizard. It's Quentin. <laughs> yeah, I kind of mean. Yeah, of course he's drinking magic potions. Yeah, come on, dude. Yeah. Why don't you get some strawberry tea? Come on. That's fine. The world started to melt. Who cares? It's fine. I did not see the glowing worm that is glowing, surprisingly. So, let me go do that. Nope, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Didn't want to do that first, I wanted to get the more powerful thingy. magic spell the mega hammer oh yeah there's one more that i have to get oh. yeah this uh this move is a uh, pretty crazy but uh i i don't like how to get it i i don't like it at all <laughs> you have to fight these two bosses and they both suck like a lot they are very difficult to beat, <laughs> and it takes me forever to beat the second one. Like, the first one is fine, it's just the second one, dude. It's awful. But boom! There's the hammer in action. So that's the hammer. It's pretty cool. But the, the next one, the final one, is way better. At least for damage-wise. It's called the Dragon Uppercut, and it's uh, pre pretty cool looking. Hopefully, I'll be able to get it <laughs> sooner rather than later, but it's probably gonna be later. <laughs> and it, and now we get introduced to my favorite character in the game. It's Meow. Look at him. He means business, but he's also pretty awesome. Yeah. He's all good. There's just a little too many. <laughs> His ninja skills. He is a ninja. Like, he's just so cool, dude. <laughs> they might be here for baking delicious pizza. You never know. Come on, you never know. Yes, Meow is an excellent cat name. And he is a ninja, and he is just amazing. So, that's why it's a good character. Let's keep going down here. Well, yeah. Also, about the, the Mega Hammer, is that it freezes enemies. It's like super useful for like this. Basically, use free stuff so that it doesn't knock you off right away. Yeah. Oh god. I forgot about jumping off of ledges. Thank you. Oh god. <laughs> oh yep. You have to jump and then move. Oh yep. <laughs> Difficult to do that jump, but it's way easy. It's right here. <laughs> I 
think this is better. But yeah, I definitely overuse the Mega Hammer sometimes and I just run out of uh, energy for it. I do that quite often. So I'm gonna try to limit myself on it. Or just hope that I get enough hit from enemies. Because yeah, I didn't need to do it there. And I didn't need to do it there. Better. And also I get to ride. A little thing, a little. Thing. I don't know what you call those, a lift. And to attack a machine. Pretty hype. Back to meow. What's up, meow? I did it. Let's go. Oh yeah, Mr. Alfonso. Mr. Alfonso is awesome, dude. Let's go, I got another power orb. Should I use it on the shuriken? I think I might just wait. I might... I might use it on the sword. Make it a little bit more powerful. And boom. Here we go, we get to meet Mr. Alfonso. Hey look, it's Mr. Alfonso! Woohoo! Oh. Um. Oh no. I didn't know Meow was a girl. No, I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. I hope I don't get cancelled. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Mr. Alfonso is the best. He's also the best, I think. But yeah. The robots definitely do not like the water, because, uh, that'll rust them out real quick. And I have to go save Mr. Alfonso's family. So I gotta go up to this, up this entire mountain. How did, what? How did that not break? Because usually it does that. How did I... Okay, I don't know what happened there. <laughs> I'm just too quick. Uh, let, me... let me get the girl one first. Let me talk to... Mr. Quinton. Behold... Maybe you tap the record. You might need to go to bed too. I know that's all of my audience right now, but still, you guys need to go to the sleep. And I might not finish tonight. I might join you in the sleep.
I'm probably gonna stop the stream soon, because, uh, yeah, it's, like, midnight for me. <laughs> but, I think a quarter is pretty good for today. Right. See ya, Captain Hack here. I can see in the dark now. Very cool. See, so, okay, I'll finish here. Um, uh, where's a near checkpoint? I just love this game a lot. <laughs> like, yeah, look at look at my hours on this game. Like, it's up to 133 now. Like, I just, I, I do love this game a lot. <laughs> so, I'm glad that I, glad that I was able to show it to you and Captain Wreckbeard. I at least showed it to someone. <laughs> And I think I think easy would be a good start because there's a lot of like more difficult modes that uh, are difficult. <laughs> but I think this is a good easing. And you're welcome. <laughs> you're welcome for the stream. It was fun. It was fun to just, yeah. And there was like a dedicated like community to this, but uh, it was a while ago, like. It came out in 2014. Like, yeah, it's it's been a little bit since like <laughs> since people have played it. Yeah, unfortunately, the community is a probably it's it's dead. But uh, hopefully, with this, with me streaming it, uh, I shall bring this community back to life, or at least bring <laughs> more people into it and yeah it's only been like eight years it's fine yeah it's all good <laughs> but yeah thanks for hanging out for the past like hour and uh i'll probably do do this soon yeah i'm reviving the community dude yeah i'm bringing a new community because I, I, I do just love this game. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> See ya.
see you later then. <laughs>